forget all you know about male lion clashes. Today, you'll witness the tale of the legendary Notch, a lion who did something entirely contrary to the usual behavior of these felines. You'll see that animals don't always adhere to their nature, they can indeed take control of their own destiny. That's precisely what this lion did, he refused to accept defeat and completely reshaped his future. Stay with us until the end. So go ahead and hit the like button and subscribe to support the channel. The lion in our story is named Notch, and he resided in the Maasai Mara Reserve in Kenya. Notch was still young when he teamed up with his war buddy, Lightmate. This happened in 2004, and they both dominated. They decided to form an alliance, making a perfect pair. They overcame various male lion reigns and were relentless, two ferocious lions. They challenged and vanquished their opponents for a long time, living in harmony as an unshakable and unbeatable duo. But, as is the way of life, time passed, and suddenly, three young lions appeared. They were responsible for the end of the invincible duo because in a confrontation, they took the life of Lightmate. Reserve staff believed that after losing his partner, Notch wouldn't last much longer on his own. However, it was precisely after this that his story began. He migrated with his pride and kept a low profile, hunting only within a specific territory, doing everything to avoid drawing the attention of the three young lions who had come to dominate the reserve. Time passed, and Notch had eight cubs, five of them being males. As time continued to flow, a new threat emerged in 2007. Another lion found Notch's group and dethroned him. He ended up as the loser but survived and did something entirely contrary to the customs of a lion. He took his five young male, who were still in their youth and about to leave the pride to form their own group. They would likely have been decimated, so instead of becoming a nomadic, solitary lion awaiting death, Notch gathered his five young sons and embarked on a journey of terror and confrontation, imparting to his descendants the true meaning of dominance. His sons possessed the vigor of youth, and Notch leveraged this by combining it with his experience, shaping them into formidable warriors and forming a perfect coalition. For a year, Notch cared for and taught his offspring about combat and hunting. In 2008, the reign of terror of the six males began in earnest, initiating the clash. Notch's sons were Notch II, Mighty Long, Caesar, and Grimace. This had never been seen in male lions before, teaching their male offspring to dominate other lions and hunt as adults. For the staff who observed this, it was something astonishing and unprecedented because lions typically do not behave in this manner. A lion training its descendants was a sight to behold. They came to dominate over a thousand square kilometers, defeating all the males who crossed their path and gaining more and more females. They became true stars in the reserve, attracting visitors from all over the world. Notch gained significant fame as he reached his peak with his coalition controlling 11 lion prides. He became globally renowned and even served as an inspiration for a Disney-produced film called African Cats in 2010. A biologist from the reserve concluded that Notch's coalition was extremely detrimental to other lions. The course of this story seemed to be taking much larger proportions than usual, and if they weren't stopped, they would eventually dominate the entire reserve and establish a new way of life for the lions. Dozens of lions were decimated during almost their entire reign. Notch was already old, but he remained the alpha among his sons, demanding respect when necessary to remind them that there was only one king, and that king was the legendary Notch. Reserve biologists believed that the king would be overthrown by his own sons because Notch was growing old and increasingly frail. They were betting that one of his sons would betray their father and steal the crown from him. Once again, this story took a surprising turn because that's not what happened. Notch's sons worked hard to keep him alive, never leaving him alone, and the strong bond between them appeared to endure. They joined forces to protect him until the last days of his life. When they needed to go out at night for hunting, Notch was left in the care of the best lionesses as his territory was vast, requiring them to split up to patrol and keep their females under control. In one of these outings, one of his sons was fatally attacked by other lions. By 2013, Notch had reached the age of 14, and he was old, weak, and very thin. He no longer had the strength to survive on his own and was reliant on the care of his sons. Upon hearing of his son's death, he was deeply shaken and withdrew from everyone. He bid farewell to his companions and began to await his own death. Months later, he lost another of his sons in a fight. There were only three of his descendants left and they were doing everything they could to uphold their father's legacy. 
In 2016 and 2017, two more of his sons lost their lives in battles for territorial dominance. And so, in the end, only his sons remained with Notch II, living up to his strong name, keeping him alive. Notch II decided that his days of fighting were over and walked alone to another reserve, staying away from conflicts. However, the unexpected happened once more in this incredible tale. Notch II reappeared months later with one of his cubs, a male, to follow in his father's footsteps, just as he had done with his brothers. The pair remained together for almost two years, with history repeating itself. But Notch II had reached a truly advanced age, and he disappeared, leaving his son alone on a nomadic and lonely journey. Unlike his father, he didn't have the time to pass on all his knowledge to his son before age took its toll. Notch breathed life into the story here in the Maasai Mara Reserve, known as the legacy of Notch being the only lion to remain in command until his last breath. Notch is considered the most successful king in the recorded history of lions on our planet. With the Notch Coalition, he had dozens of cubs in the Maasai Mara Reserve. Today, these descendants are closely monitored to see if history repeats itself because the genes they carry could potentially trigger such behavior at any time. Others believe that it won't happen again because a lion like Notch is one of a kind and there won't be another like him. Notch was undoubtedly a remarkable and influential figure, shaping his own destiny and leaving a significant mark. It's always awe-inspiring to witness the capabilities of animals in the wild as they adapt and survive. I wasn't aware of this specific story, but it's a testament to the resilience and adaptability of wildlife. I'd say that I found the story of Notch and his legacy truly fascinating and a testament to the complexity of animal behavior. It's a reminder of how nature constantly surprises us. I'd also encourage others to share their thoughts and opinions in the comments section to engage in discussions about this incredible story. Don't forget to subscribe and like the video to support the channel's growth and the sharing of more such remarkable stories. Thank you for watching and until next time.